Hello and welcome to my kitchen. A bit of a weird place to be filming a skincare video, but today I'm going to be filming my morning and my evening skincare routine. I am going to be posting a pamper routine as well very soon, so stay tuned for that. And that includes a little bit more kind of in depth things that I would do to my skin and my body, like tanning, etc. So stay tuned for that. But I wanted to start off this video by saying that I am heavily into body shop skincare. When I sold products for them, I ended up really loving the products. I've done many hauls on my channel. I've got another haul coming very soon of body shop products. <laughs> Can't help myself, I just love it. And also I noticed such a massive difference in my skin when I actually follow a skincare routine. So before this video starts, I just wanted to quickly say that my skin is not looking as good as usual. Like literally like lately it's been looking so good. My online exams hit, don't wear any makeup. And when I don't wear makeup, my skin ends up spotty because I touch my face. So that's why I like wearing makeup because it stops me from touching my face. And actually my skin is so much better when I wear makeup because of that reason. But I do have spots, just means I need to uh, spend some more time using my tea tree oil. But I thought I would just explain that to you. A few weeks ago, I went a bit off track wasn't really following a skincare routine and my skin kind of felt a little bit dry now it's so soft it's so glowy it's so much more nice to put makeup on and it just so much clearer so this is my updated skincare routine it works to clear your skin and give you nice soft glowy skin obviously i do have the products that i've got on my website which i'll link in the description my website is my website is freshfaceskincare.shop so please go check that out. I've got some new products going on there soon. I have got a face mask. It's a tea tree detox face mask. I love that for when I've got spots because it clears them and also I've got my tea tree oil which I use daily which you'll see in a second but I'm also adding on my oven just made a break noise. Oh and so did the alarm. Scary. Bath bombs I'm adding to my website. This one is peppermint. It's a blue peppermint bath bomb. This one is a pink eucalyptus scented bath bomb. I'm going to have loads of different flavours and scents and colours, everything like that. And they are really nice. So please check that out ready for when they go on my website. But apart from that, let's get into the video. So we are going to begin with morning skincare. This is a lot more basic than my evening skincare. First of all, I go in with a cleanser. Like I said, most products from the Body Shop, probably don't need to say that it is, but this is the Body Shop Drops of Youth Gentle Foaming Wash. This is in like a foam consistency. It is in like a liquefied version. When you pump it out, it does turn it into a foam. And I really like this cleanser. It does feel like it's really cleaning my skin and that's what I like. I like cleansers that really feel like they're cleansing my skin and really getting in there, not just something that's kind of gentle. I like to feel really clean, so I do really love that. It is running out, so I have ordered another one from the body shop, but it's a different one. I've ordered a carrot wash, but you'll see that in a future haul. Once I wash my face, all I'm doing in the morning is just simply cleansing, then I go straight in with skincare products. So this is from Lidl. This is, I think it's CN, CN, or, I don't know. It's the Q10 Intensive Serum. It's got hyaluronic acid in it, and I know how good hyaluronic acid is for hydration in your skin. It really plumps the skin and hydrates it, and this particular product I swear by, I love this serum so much and it's only two pounds something from Lidl. This is a gem. So if you're watching this video, go and check this out. It really is. It softens your skin so much. So I put that on. Then I use this moisturizer, which every time I buy a new moisturizer, I always say this, well, every time I buy a new one from the body shop, but this one genuinely is the best moisturizer I've ever tried. This is the body shop vitamin E gel moisture cream. So it's not a typical moisturizer, it's actually a gel consistency. But oh my God, this is so glowy on your skin. Like it makes your skin so glowy and feels so hydrated and just usual moisturizers will kind of blend in, but you can really feel it on the skin. And this just looks so glowy and I'm here for the glow. Like I'm really addicted to skincare at the minute. I'm investing money, well not investing, but I'm, spend I'm spending money on skincare rather than makeup these days. And I'm here for it. I like it. So yeah, this, love this. Will I repurchase 1 million percent? It is new to the body shop and Judge Carl would recommend. 
Then I've got this, which is SPF. So this is the Body Shot Vitamin C. Sorry. Sorry, I thought someone was trying to enter and I'm due a post. I'm due a post. The post might be coming. I don't know what I'm saying. But yeah, this is the Body Shot Vitamin C Glow Protect Lotion with SPF 30. So this is something that I bought because I use sun cream every day on my skin because you have to, you should do, if you want your skin to not wrinkle as much when you're older and to just not age as quickly, then you need to use sun cream and also you just need to protect yourself in general from the sun. Even when you think it's not sunny, the sun is still out, it will still um, affect your skin. So yeah, this is the one that I've got. It's so glowy, it's from the vitamin C range which is all about glow and just making your skin really nice. It says it's for dull, tired and grumpy skin. I love this product. It does make my skin really glowy and obviously it's protecting my skin at the same time. So this is basically like my SPF step. Then I kind of nearly finish off my morning skincare routine with the Body Shop Hem Heavy Duty Lip Care. This is just a lip balm. I really like this. Just pop it on my lips, keeps them moisturized, stops them getting dry, though they don't really get dry anyway, but I just like to use this. Then to finish off my skincare routine, this is a product that I love so much. I really, really, really do. This is the Body Shop Vitamin C Energizing Face Mist. So I think you can probably tell I do love the Vitamin C range. I've got the Liquid Peel. I've got the Skin Reviver, which is a primer. And I have the Moisturizer. Honestly, like I do really love their products in that particular range because it's all about glow and I'm here for the glow. So this is what I put onto bare skin. I was gonna use it as a setting spray for makeup, but I found that it just looks so good on your actual skin and it just makes your skin so nice and glowy. And that is what I'm here for. I love glowy products. And yeah, spray this on and your skin will look so glowy. If you're having a no makeup day, which I do probably like two times a week, then your skin will be really nice and glowy all day. And it's because of this product. And I really love that and I will repurchase that. So that is my morning skincare routine. I will then go and apply apply makeup about 20 minutes after or if I'm having a no makeup day then I will just leave it like that for the rest of the day. Now for nighttime skincare which does get a little bit more involved. So first of all if I'm wearing makeup I will take off my makeup using the Body Shop Camomel Sumptuous Cleansing Butter. This stuff is amazing. I do also have their cleansing oil as well, but this is definitely my favorite thing. It literally melts your makeup off. Like I've got a full face on now. This will take my makeup off in seconds. It's so good. I'll just rub this into my skin, then remove it with like either a wet wipe or I try not to, but I'll either remove it with a wet wipe or you can use a muslin cloth or just something like that basically, or just remove it with water um, if you want to. So that's kind of like the removal stage. Some people will just leave it there and that's them done. I don't like doing that because you've still got product on your face and you just still need that extra cleanse. So I like to double cleanse. Again, go in with the Drops of Youth Gentle Foaming Wash as well. So that's kind of cleansing my skin. When it comes to exfoliators and stuff, I will show that in my pamper routine. So exfoliation and, and liquid peels, I will show in my pamper routine because that's not something I do daily. So I will then use a face mask. I remove my makeup before my workout at about five o'clock. I will then do my workout. After my workout, I'll do a face mask. Now I've got many face masks. I've got about seven. Pretty much all of them are from the body shop. I do alternate between using them. Each face mask has got different benefits. Some is for reducing spots. Some's for glowy skin. Some of them are for soothing the skin and making it soft. Many different ones, however, this one is my face mask that's on my website, like I said, linked in the description. And this is my detox clay face mask with tea tree in it. I love this and I'm gonna use it tonight. And basically the reason why I love this, obviously I'm gonna be a bit biased, but I do really like this is because it does clear your spots. It is the perfect product for clearing your spots if you have them. It just makes my skin so fresh and clean. You leave it on for about 10, 15 minutes until it's dried, wash it off, it washes off really easily and yeah, your skin is really, really clear. I would recommend using this. If you don't have any other face mask and you just use this, I would recommend using this probably two to three times a week or once a week if you can't manage the time, but I do a face mask every day because I like it. So 
I'll do my face mask, remove it, then, la then later on in the day, I will do my actual skincare routine. So first of all, I go in with this toner. This is from The Body Shop. It's a seaweed oil balancing toner. It's for combination to oily skin, which is basically my skin type. I use these like reusable cotton pads that Steph got me for, I think it was Christmas. And I love these, these are so good. Like you literally just, they're so soft. You apply um, your toner to it, put it around your skin and then you can just reuse and wash it. I probably use this about three times before I wash it, um, but I do have loads of others as well. I really like this toner and it's definitely not something to get if you have got dry skin. Next thing I go in with is an essence lotion. I love essence lotions. Some people might say that they're not worth the money or that they're just pointless. I don't think so. They're there for hydration. This is nearly run out, but this is the Drops of Youth Essence Lotion from The Body Shop. This stuff feels so hydrating and just basically that is the word hydrating it is full of hydration for the skin and that's why i love it like it's literally just at the end um i have purchased a new essence lotion it's from the oils of life range but i do also still have another essence lotion anyway i use two the third step in my skincare routine products and this is the body shop roots of strength firming shaping essence lotion now this is not a product that you need if you are my age I just had this because I got it for free doing the body shop, but I do it selling body shop products when I used to do the body shop at home. But yeah, this stuff kind of makes your skin feel really plump and like it says, quite firm, which is quite nice for when you apply makeup on, but it is meant to kind of reduce fine lines and things like that for people that are a little bit older than me. Then I go in with my serum. This is again from Lidl, showed it in my morning routine. That's what I then go in with. Then I will moisturise. Also, I do leave a, like a minute, sort of 30 seconds to a minute between each, between each step, which means that each product has a chance to sink in. When you're applying the products, really work it into your skin, really rub it in, don't just slap it on, done. Really work it into the skin and then leave it for about a minute, apply the next product so that each layer has a chance to sink in. But yeah, then I go in with my moisturiser that I've already mentioned, the Gel Moisture Cream from the Vitamin E range. This is Oh my God, my favorite product of this entire video. It's so good. Then after that, I know that this is quite a long routine. It's long for some people, long for most people anyway. Um, but yeah, I use the Bye Bye Strawberry Booster. It's 100% natural, cruelty free and vegan. So this is like basically an oil. I just love seeing my skin really glowy and this makes it super, super, super um, shiny and glowy. And it just makes me feel good putting it on. So I don't really know what this does, but I'm sure it, sure it does something. <laughs> Um, and then my other product from my website. So these are my two little skincare products, but this is the tea tree oil. Also, by the way, my face mask is very low on stock. So if you did want one, go and get it now because I won't be able to restock for a long while due to the coronavirus, meaning that the person I buy, well, not the person, the brand that I buy packaging off is not selling them at the minute. So they're very low in stock, but this is my tea tree oil, this is 30 ml. Usually when you see this, it will be 10 ml, like when you see other people's tea tree oils, because it is powerful, you only need a little bit. I like the fact that with mine, you've got a pipette, so it's just very controllable. You can control how much you um, like want and use, and yeah, this stuff is gold dust when you've got spots. I just, after my routine, pop a little bit onto my cotton pad in a specific area, and then just dab it and press it on, to those spots it's not something that you'll put all over your skin because it will dry your skin out and then finally i will go in with the hemp heavy duty lip care again this is just a lip balm that i use over my lips just to keep them nourished overnight and that is my evening skincare routine so that is everything for my general day-to-day -day skincare routine when i stick to this which i tend to especially these days my skin is looking really glowy really clear really nice and soft and it just makes me feel really happy so i would highly recommend having a little bit of a self-care routine favorite products from this video has got got to be the moisturizer and really like the little serum as well oh and the glowy and um, vitamin c spray that i use in the morning as well that product is fantastic if you want to go and check out the products that are on my website please do it's linked in the description give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe for more content on my channel and i will see you in my next video goodbye pamper routine coming very soon